Hello everyone. Um, I have a little bit more time, so I'm playing in Cockatrice Weekly as well. And I'm playing what I call sort of an aggro deck, four color aggro deck, no white. Um, it's sort of halfway between an aggro deck and a mid-range deck. I don't really think that I would normally call it mid-range because it is pretty proactive. But it's also not, you know, 40 creatures or whatever that you would normally expect from a true aggro deck. Um, basically, I was inspired by Minstrel's take on check and Zoe's take on uh, low, low to the ground four color blood and wanted to make a four color aggro deck. I think blue is heavily underexplored in aggro decks. Uh, typically blue is a controlling color. When you think blue, you think counter spells, you think uh, cantrips, that sort of thing. And it's not like I don't have cantrips. I'm running under Preordain, uh, Brainstorm, you know, the usual. And I'm running, you know, a handful of counter spells. By a handful, I mean two Mental Misstep and Spell Pierce. But they've made some pretty juiced up blue threats over the years. Uh, in particular, MH3 gave us Psychic Frog and Nadu, which I think are just kind of absurd cards. Um, also, things like Oko. Oko is a pretty good uh, mid range card. Royal Scions is actually good when you're attacking, which is not what a lot of blue decks really do. So the idea of this deck is basically play a bunch of fast mana and get things out, um, get two and three drops out super early, and use a bunch of card advantage engines to just sort of grind out the game. It's meant to be a lot more grindy than like a pure aggro deck, but it is meant to be pretty fast. Um, this deck is base Jund. Base like blue-green, not blue-green, oh my god, Jund. It's base uh, black-green with a bunch of red, and then blue is just a really light splash, uh, as you can see down here. And I just sort of wanted to explore what happens if you take an aggro deck and just sort of pop up the card quality. Um, because most aggro decks deliberately get rid of card quality in order to try and be more aggressive, and I'm not sure that's necessary anymore. There's not a lot of Price of Progresses or Blood Moons and stuff running around, so there's really not a lot of punishment for being 4-color. Uh, and, you know, if you can't beat the 4-color decks, why not join them? Um, cards I think I really want to see pop off are Infamous Cruel Claw, T Detective's Phoenix, obviously Nadu and Psychic Frog. Got things like Anya's Ravager for some um, card advantage. Minsk and Boo obviously is always good, but yeah, it's basically just four color good stuff pile, but rather than being controlling, this is trying to be more aggressive. So I haven't gotten to play it at all, but I think it'll be pretty cool. This is sort of like what I would think a new age four color blood looks like um, in terms of everything is just good in the deck. Um, it's not necessarily pure aggro, but it is aggressively slanted midrange. So let's see how it does today. For this, for this high high, high stakes um, footage, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, right. okay. It's a while since I've played. Oh yeah, I'll keep this. Yeah, sure, me too. Sample uh, garden untapped. Cast a but uh, no, eight vial. Good, you didn't have that. Either vial paradise. <laughs> <laughs> Go Burn Catacombs, Mox Jet. Oh, yeah. Fetch. Yeah. A. I guess. this Inti. Oh, yeah. yeah. Um, <laughs> on top. Upkeep. Compile trigger. Yeah. Uh, drop. Um, meticulous archive. Sure. In this noble hierarch. Go ahead. Okay. Uh, let's go to combat. Mm -hmm. I'll attack with Inti. I'll target himself sure. and pitch this endurance. Sure. I can main. Play the Mana Confluence. Play a Death Rite Shaman. Mm -hmm. Cast Reanimate, targeting my Endurance. Sure. 
two, three. Uh, I guess I'll tuck your yard, why not? <clears throat> yeah, sure. And say go. And set and file. Yeah. And set. Mm. Oh, do you mind if I do my file trigger? That was yeah, yeah, that's fine. Dumb. I cut this from D and T because of exactly that. Um, Marsh flats. Okay. Find a lush portico. Mm -hmm. Then this prismatic vista. Cast renegade rally. Uh, yep. Step back. Prismatic vista. Go ahead. And step. I'll cycle this all upon. Sure. Trigger indeed. Sure. Speeder. I'll go get a Volcanic Island. <clears throat> Tap draw. Three, two. Uh Go to combat. Mm -hmm. Attack with Inti and Endurance. Inti trigger will target itself. Sure. I'll pitch this Anya's Ravager, which all madness. Oh, yeah. Sure. Uh, and Inti trigger reveals Veronica. Okay. Mm -hmm. I'll take seven. Okay. In this volcanic island, I'd like to eat your marsh flats with death right. Sure. Play Veronica. Okay. Say go. Keep the vile trigger. Draw. Mm, let's go to game two. Okay. <laughs> Flood it out a little bit. Didn't draw, any, didn't draw any more non lines. Had a pretty good start too. Oh, no. I'll do that, yeah. <laughs> play. Uh, I'll keep this sure. Uh, yeah, me too. Uh, Tropical Island. That's Paris. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, Blood Saint Meyer fetch. Mm -hmm. Get a Bayou. Play a noble hierarch. Sure. There you go. Play a meticulous archive. Okay. I think I'd like to keep that on top. Cast third pen. Okay. Go ahead. Play this wasteland and hit your archive. Okay. Play this psychic frog. Oh, sure. Okay, this is That's like a madness deck. It's cool. Um, Lush Portico. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Put this scolding time in the graveyard. Well, I think I've got to do this. Time walk. Sure. It's like explore. Uh, that's it. Hallowed Fountain. Under Mountain. Okay. Find. Basic forest. Mm -hmm. Snow covered forest effect. Go ahead. Okay. Oh. Uh, 
Uh, we'll activate Psychic Frog. Discarding this over into. Sure. We'll activate Psychic Frog. Discarding the Swamp. Sure. I'd like to give Psychic Frog flying. Sure. I'm gonna give Psychic Frog another counter. Sure. Go to combat. <clears throat> Take four. Yeah, for five, because of the exalt trigger. Oh yeah, sure. Give me an under city. Uh, God, what order do these triggers go? Do I get the, un the initiative first, or do I draw, or is it, do I choose? Uh, it's my, the initiative trigger is mine, uh, so the initiative happens first. Okay, so I go get a basic first. I'll get a basic mountain, I guess. Uh, then I draw for Psychic Frog. Mm -hmm. Second main. Play this mountain. Play Sentinel of the Nameless City. Sure. Map. There you go. Oh, whoops. I'm going to undo a draw on Shuffle. No good forest. Um, yeah, attack with both of these. Uh, block the spirit companion. Sure. I'll take the initiative. Yeah, I take three. Put two candles on this thing. Um, I'll cast Extraction Specialist. Sure. Get back. Spirit companion, draw card. Yep. Cast Wall Blossoms. Okay. Draw card. Yeah. Right. Upkeep draw. Interesting. Um. We're going to activate Psychic Frog. Sure. Discard this mana confluence, then we'll jump the Psychic Frog. Sure. Combat. Attack for six in the air. Take six. Uh, I get the other city. I guess I'll forge onto my Sentinel of the Nameless City. Sure. Uh, and I draw. Um, let's go one, two, for this Molten Collapse, targeting your Undermountain Adventure. Okay. Then I'll play this Volcanic Island and this Dragon's Rage Channeler. Okay. And... I'll use this map token on the Dragon's... Rage Channeler. Okay. Deal top cards to all players. One. It's a questing druid. That's fine. I can stay on top. I'll pass. Yeah. Um. <laughs> I'm going to think about my line here. Okay. Go 
want to Neo form the spirit canyon. Okay. Find a eternal witness. Okay. Just gonna get back high more. I'm going to play this temple garden. Cast time walk. Yep. Essence blocks my time witness. Get back my uniform. Yep. Right. Uh, let's the counter. Um, move to my next turn. Yep. Near from the water blossoms. Yeah, and then you can get Spellseeker for a few. I'm Spellseeker, right? Yeah. Yep. I'll find okay. you. I'm right. I'm right, okay. Spellseeker. Game three. <laughs> okay. Game three, indeed. That's close. Yeah. Mm. Yeah, sure. I'll try this too. Aaron Mesa, Fetch, and Tiger. Hmm. Play a Mox Diamond. Okay. Fetch this Misty. Play this Rock on. Okay. So there you go. What's up? Oh, come on. I think I have just my settings changed or something. Let's undo that drone shuffle. Um. Go Island Palmia. Good. Okay. Uh, I'll bomb cycle this troll costume. Sure. Get a underground sea. Tap up, keep draw. Play the underground sea. I'll blood juice thirst your Tamiya. Sure. Attack you with Ragavan. Sure. A fortune, if you'd like it. Or, uh, I care about this. Uh, no, I'll just leave that in exile. That's fine. Uh, go ahead. So. Go wooded for hills. Yeah. Find a savannah. Cast a Dapple Mage. Uh, sure. Okay. Strong. It's long. Cast the Avenger side of this Mosswood Dread Knight. Sure. Fish. Um, yeah, I guess I'm just playing the Mosswood Dread Knight. Okay. And pass it. So. One three, it's in this economy. Indeed. I find Corathal. Yep. Go ahead. I mean, I guess. Cap with Dreadfew cleaved. 
Uh, it was a good choice, but also some. This. <laughs> um. Hmm. Yeah, I'm wondering whether I should, whether, if I should have played the vial. I don't think I was supposed to just let you run on me. But I, maybe you just definitely had a kill spell? I don't know. Um, weird, I, think. I guess I'm taking the birthing pod. Okay. Not sure if that's right, but... Uh... Go to combat, attack with the dripping. I'll take three. Yeah. Pass me, claim and take myself guys. Yeah. Keep that on top. I'll just uh, time walk. Sure. Thank you for one. Yep. Oh, actually, but sorry, oh, I should have done that for two. Do you mind if I have done that for two? I'm just done. Uh, just not have attacked. Well, okay. Oh. okay. If you want to attack with both yeah. of them? Sure. I have a response then. Oh, sure. Interesting. Uh, I'm going to like this as quick reflex as my boss would make. Oh, I see. Okay. Yeah, that happens. I'll block your gap for Sure. Go my next turn. And my next turn. Uh, I think you're. you're your thing isn't dead. My thing's a 1-3. Oh, it's a 1-3. Yeah. Sweet. <laughs> okay. Well, there's a good sweet teeth. Yeah. Um, I think I'm just going to... I've got less knife than you. Yeah, let's get it. Let's stretch. Oh. This thing's kind of annoying. I don't know. I don't have an yeah, ancient yeah. pod right away. So it's like sort of a problem. Yeah, yeah. I don't, I don't. Yeah, I don't think what you did was incorrect. Um, I'm glad to know that you would rip two lanes off the top. You know. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Uh, let's go for just a baser. Yeah. Okay, game four. Um, and don't do anything else. I don't think. Right. No. Go. Draw. Okay. We're getting somewhere. I'm gonna seek the beast. <laughs> mm -hmm. Sure. That's pretty good. Yeah. That's not bad. But it could have been better, <laughs> let's be honest. Yeah, so it certainly could have been better, yeah. Uh, knocked in this overgrown tomb. Way questing druid. Death right shaman counter on questing druid. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Five, four or five for sure. Um, it isn't. Is it? That, that's part, so part mostly why the card's good. <laughs> yep. Go I, 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 I joke that it's it's white shield red. Play this cradle. Mm -hmm. It does a good thing to draw. Don't push mistake. Sure. Find a probably formal wear. I know that you are the world's biggest defender of Cauldra. Do you play Cauldra in this deck? <laughs> no, no, not not in this not, not in this deck. <laughs> I'm actually kind of I'm, I'm considering cutting it. I, I've I've in my non mono white builds. I I I don't play it. Um, all I can say is I feel like minstrel. <laughs> That's my right. deck, and I am flooding out. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna float with green, uh, cast form where. Sure. Get back, garport mage. Yep. Um. May as well use the screen on the vial. <laughs> Go ahead. Let's keep draw. Okay. Well, 
there were going to be any draws to get me out of this, that is certainly probably one of the better ones. <laughs> Things can move. Well, that is a good one. That, that is a good one, yeah. Now you have an Uro. I think... I'm likely to die. Okay, so it all comes in and makes a poop. Mm -hmm. Four or five. <laughs> oh yeah. Um. Yeah, we'll up pick on this. Mm -hmm. Okay, that's good. <laughs> okay. Uh, upkeep. Vile for good. I don't know if the stuff flies. Sure. I'll attack Minsk and Boo with these things. Uh, well, I can't block the Ice Fang. I'll block the Beza with the Muscle Dread Knight. Okay. <clears throat> I guess it's in my it's technically in my graveyard, so Yeah. Let's Dowerport Mage, my Baser. Sure. Actually do I want to do no, I wanna do Cradle first before yeah. Okay. Get this back. Draw. Uh yeah. Pass. Um, yeah. Uh, yeah. Mm. Okay, go. Uh, We're just recasting Vaza? Yeah. You know, gets away, gets, gets away Glamour for the second mode. Targeting. No other, creature, no other creature has greater power. Uh, can I do anything about that? No. Okay. You got me. Playing the world's most niche <laughs> removal spell. <laughs> The cast Uro. Sure. Go ahead. Uh, in step, I'd like to eat your Uro. Sure, makes sense. Untap, upkeep, make a boo. Mm -hmm. uh, draw off return. Uh, I guess I'll cast the Cataxin Probe for life trigger. Sure. Targeting you. Oh, good. <laughs> more, more random junk. Okay. Uh... What, what, what did you expect? If anything, but, but random junk. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> yeah. uh, let's cast this. Mothwood Dread Knight for its adventure from the graveyard. Uh, trigger questing through it. Mm -hmm. There we go. What about the back row? Uh, ask this ponder trigger. Sure. The top three. Okay. Yeah, this is fine. We'll leave it like this and draw this card. 
I will crack this treasure for a blue. Cast treasure cruise. I'll leave. Sure. Good. Mm hmm. All three. Okay. Play this. Box jet. Play this. Red and six. Trigger questing druid. Mm -hmm. Sure. I will down tick Ren and six to ping your ice fang wall. Sure. Oh, this is in the graveyard. Um, then I will uptick Minskin Boo on the Boo. Sure. Oops. And sure, I'll go to combat. Mm hmm. Yeah, I don't think I need to get in with Ragabon. I'll attack with the Questing Druid in the... Hey. Ooh. So that's 12. Mm -hmm. yeah, I think I have to block. Yeah. Okay. Take four. Take four. Uh, then I will pass. That turn. <laughs> that turn changed a lot. Oh, shit. Do you mind if I put up my yeah, file? Fine. File's fine. Thank yeah, you. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Activate file. Uh, sure. Yeah, exactly. They're okay. Yeah. Mm. Go for. Let's go for Mockingbird. Uh, it's two mana, X right? is one. Yeah. yeah. Uh, yep. That's going to happen. Choose, choose a Johnny. Okay. Legend. legend make, make, make a token. Legend rule. Yep. Clever Johnny. Yep. Suddenly, um, there's lots of cats. Make a cat. There are indeed a lot of cats. Like one, two, three, four. Cast Phaser. Which doesn't do anything. Uh, no, I draw hard. a card. There we go. Um, go ahead. Uh, and step by, I'd like to eat your time walk from your graveyard. Makes sense. Tap. I guess I'll make a boo and let the boo die to the legend rule. Uh, mm -hmm. I know you have. Hmm. If I do that, it's a 7-7, seven, seven, which means those would probably have to give up something. Four, so it's 
Um, please buy you. I guess Canker Bloom. Mm -hmm. Play the Monster Dread Knight. Mm -hmm. He will down take Brennan Six to ping a Cap Warrior. Okay. Just catch it in. Well, uptake means can blow on the blue token. Okay. Uh, go to combat. Mm -hmm. I'm going to attack a Johnny with the boo and attack you with the Block. Block. Uh, okay, are those your only blocks? Yep. I'll sack the canker bloom to blow up the pre-war formal wear. Okay. So, yep, my Johnny dies. Yep. So, Johnny got purple die, and cat warrior dies. Mm -hmm. Uh, and then I will just pass the turn, I think. <laughs> Three. <laughs> Back to the same file. Yep. Put a soul herder in. Okay. Move to my end step. Blink baser. Uh, I'll make it two fish. Make two fish, and then also yeah, that's it. Just make two fish. Okay. Uh, Go ahead. On the end step, I will also. I guess I'll eat your um, getaway glamour. Okay. One tap. Do the boo thing. Raw. Mm -hmm. uh, sorry, in your in your um, in your upkeep. Sorry, right. I, I guess in your draw step. In, in, in your draw step, it doesn't matter too much. Okay. Just before your main before your main phase, I'd like to march your boot token. Uh, one minute for that, eh? Oh, <laughs> that's a bit stuff. Uh, sure. As a warrior, I'll be a token. <laughs> okay. Didn't even let me trigger my soul herder. Very rude. Yeah. How oh, is it any creature? Whenever a creature is exiled from the battlefield, we can't from it. Yeah. Okay, I learned. Okay. Um, See, even Modern Horizons cards from 2019 were kind of pushed. Yeah. <laughs> uh, no cards in hand, but you're going to keep doing this Beza thing, which is really annoying. Oh, yeah. I don't know what this deck is for if it's not supposed to be annoying. Yeah, that's fair. Um, 
Let's go to combat. Tag you with both of these. Uh, uh, no, that doesn't actually matter. Let's just block that. Okay. Take three. Uh, we're going to set Finskin Boo to, to loyalty. Throw my questing mm -hmm. druid at your base up. Sure. Uh, and then the most powerful play known to man. Cast Elder Spirit Guide. <laughs> Holy shit. Okay, I'm scared. Uh, I wanted to leave this one in six. Um... Maybe. Just up there. There you go. Yep. Very interesting. Um. Hmm. I'm. I don't think this thing. This mind sense is going to help much. I think I'm just dead. Yes, indeed. Good game. Good game. Uh, this is high stakes magic, you know. <laughs> All of the marbles. I'll pick the play. Good luck. Uh, I keep him his hand. Sure. I'll try to say. We'll go to six. Okay. Keeping six. Okay. Mountain. Go. Here you started magic. We'll tap. Up the draw. Then swept he. Ray. And draw. Thunder. That's a pile of cards. Keep it like this and draw. Okay. Pass. I will cycle this draw card to do. Yes. Get myself a bite. Hunter, keep draw. This bayou cast as Lotus Petal? Yes. Cast as Veronica Distance Bride. Uh, yes. Go. And tap. I'll keep draw. See how good it is. Okay. Right. Walk one. Bottom the other. Okay. Gemstone nine. Yeah. Okay, untap draw. Uh, let's go to combat. Yeah. Attack with Veronica. I will loot away this Moloch. Uh, draw a card, make junk. Yes, take three. Yep. Second main. Let's crack this junk. Yes. Uh, I guess I'll you. Good uh, talk. Uh, I 
sure. I hope it's the card I put there. Interesting. Uh, I will... Inquisition of Puzzle IQ. Uh... I see. Um... Mm-hmm. Oh. Okay. Uh, I guess I'm taking the moon silver key. And then I will pass the turn and draw on your upkeep for the bubble. Untap upkeep. Uh, I draw. Let's get a defense grid and pass. Draw. Interesting. Yes, I know that you have a balance, which is kind of annoying. Go to combat. Attack with Take three. Veronica. I'll discard this Anya's Ravager. Madness it. Make a junk. Yeah. Um, I will play this Luda Delta. And fetch. Get myself a tropical island and cast this ponder. Yes. Hmm. I don't think any of these are necessary. I'll shuffle. Oh. Oh. Um yep. Pass the turn. <laughs> Tap, up, keep, draw. Just passing, okay. Untap, keep. Hey, this bloodstained mire. Fetch. Get myself a Badlands. Cast. Do I need to cast anything? Let me discard my hand anyway. Uh, yeah. We'll just make you have it. Minsk and Boo. Results. Make a Boo. That's it. Oh, we're gonna uptick on the Boo. Yep. Combat. Attack yes. with everything. Uh, Rav I'll do the Ravager trigger first, discarding Orcish Bowmaster's Pyrogoyf, Dismember, and Endurance. Draw three. I also make a junk. One, two, three. And I will use Veronica to discard this Prismatic Vista and draw. Uh, so, 10 damage. Go to three. Uh, pass the turn. Untap, upkeep, draw. Mm 
that one's. Yep. Um, I lose all my creatures. Then I lose two lands. It'll be this mountain and tropical island. Uh, yeah, you discarded. Okay. You discard brain freeze, advance. Black Lotus? Yes. Past it. End step. Black Lotus for triple blue. Cast Dress Down. Draw cut. Okay. Yeah. Pass the back. And, uh, well, I'm still going to make a boo in the upkeep. Uh off for turn. Okay. Uh, let's crack a chunk token. Ruby. Play the Mox Ruby. Uh, Crack another junk token, why not? Okay. Let's cast Dread Fuke targeting you. Let's um. do Solitude Thought somewhere, somehow. I'll take the Infernal Tutor. Then I'll play this Burden Catacombs and fetch. Get a Swamp. Play this off agent. Yes. And I can actually just minus and throw the off agent. <clears throat> yes. I am okay. dead. Game two. I will take the play. Sounds like a plan. I will go to sex. Yeah, me too. I'm going to go to five. I'll keep the six. I think what I'm bottoming. Uh, I guess it's this one. You good to go? Uh, yep. Vault Serum Visions. Okay. Off one bottom, the other. Pass. Uh, play this. March flats and fetch. Okay. Badlands. Cast a Mox Emerald. Cast a Territorial Kabu. Yes. There you go. Untap. Keep draw. Ottawa. Moon Silver Key. Go. Okay. Draw. Play this. Grisly Bill. Yes. Windswept Heath trigger at a counter to Kabu. Yes. Fetch, go and get a tropical island. Uh, I'll get something different. I'll get a bayou instead. Put a counter on Kavu. Uh, the base 3 3. And I will dread feud you. Uh, 
uh, I have to take Brain Freaks. It's the only legal target. <clears throat> yes, and it's then getting exiled. Yeah. But... Yeah, and then I will attack and exile the Brain Freeze. Uh, and you were fine. Cool. Uh, go ahead. Uh, under city service. Yep. Let's bin that and pass. Draw. I will play this wasteland counter on Bill. Waste your undersea sewers. Then attack. I will loot away this. Go ahead. And we'll turn Crack Moon Silver Key. Uh, let's get a black lotus. Yep. Untap. Okay. Draw. And I just dead. Not quite. Uh, black Lotus, Cracker yep. Triple Black, Cast Deceit. Yep. As far as I know? Oh. I'm Get balanced. One. <laughs> cast Founding of the First Pair. Oh uh, <laughs> do it to us ability to cast Balance. Discard a card. I guess I will discard this air Go. Yeah, that, that was impressive. Tap, keep draw. I'm, I'm still gonna get dust. Like I dash this Ragavan. Yes. Attack for two. Ouch! You get an e tutor. Will cast that like tutor using this treasure. Go yes. Find Detective Phoenix. Detective Phoenix, nice. Should be. Oh. <laughs> There's only five DMC in my graveyard. That's okay. All right. Uh, pick up Ragavan. Yes. Untap. Okay. Draw. And goes to two, I mill four. Yeah. Land go. I, know, I'm getting, I, I felt so clever. Uh, <laughs> oh, I, I was fully expecting a main deck spell bomb. Uh, yeah. uh, well, we're going to dash this rock again. Take two. Yep. Mental note. I'll cast the mental note. Mill. Elvish Spirit Guide. Workish Pro Masters. Draw. Pick up this rabbit on. Go. <laughs> Untap. I'll keep draw. Founding goes to three. And that's the strategic planning. Okay. You get binned. You get binned. You go to hand. 
You get exile. Yep. Land. Cratchit. Yep. Let's get a scrub land. So let's get a scrub land. Honestly, no one said a letter. Uh, uh, pass the turn I effect in your upkeep. Uh, yep. Upkeep. Silence you. Hey, too light for missed up. And I'm dead. Okay. Oh. <laughs> Seven. Okay, I'll take the play. That does not right. go well. <laughs> Good luck. Yep. Uh, hmm. Sure, this hand seems fine. I'm all in this. Uh, I have to think about this hand. I will also have to mulligan this hand. Okay. And a five. I will keep this hand. Okay. I'll start with a prismatic vista and pass. I'll play an Uza Saga. Okay. Pass. I'm going to fetch and get a basic swamp, and then I'm going to mountain cycle this Olapont for a volcanic island. Untap, keep, draw. Uh, play this IR's Oath Sworn. And mm -hmm. say go. All right, I'll take over the saga. Yeah, I tell. I'm slash the what's one. Okay. Yes. Um. Cast this brainstorm. Yep. Back and this one back. Play this marsh flats and fetch a bayou and play this noble hark. Then I'll say go. I will uh, tap as a stagger for colorless. Sure. I'll go find Ox Emerald. Mm -hmm. I will play a less portico tapped to veil one. Okay. I will put Wagavan in my graveyard. Okay. Pay three or White Bloom Adventure. Okay. I'll go looking for. I'll go looking for a mountain. Okay. And that's your go. All right. 
Untap to keep draw. Play this Mox Jet. One, two, three, four. A Minskin Boo. Yep. Boo and uptick on it. Go to combat. Attack. Exalted trigger for five. I'll take five. Okay. I'll take the initiative. Yep, I'll get the initiative. I will go get a basic mountain. Second main, I'll play this mountain. I will flame slash your white plume adventurer. Yep. And then I will dread fugue targeting you. Uh... Yes. Uh, my only legal target is the Iga Instigator. <laughs> and then I will pass. In one, I'll play Mountain. Yep. I'll pay four for a seasoned engineer. I'll take back the initiative. Yep. I will go to forge. I will put two plus one plus one counters on seasoned engineer. Okay. And I will pass it then. All right. Untap. Uh, upkeep. I'll make a boo and let it rule the smaller one. Yep. Uh, I'll pick Minskin Boo on Boo Token. Yeah. I will. Or I go to combat. Let's play out this Indy and this mm -hmm. Charmagoyf. Yeah. I will attack for 8 with the Boo. I will take 8. I will go into the uh, forge and put two counters on the Tarmogoyf. Which, by my count, is currently a base 5-6. So I have land, sorcery, yeah. and creature, and you have enchantment. Yes. So it's currently a 7-8. Yes. Uh, then I will pass. Tap upkeep. Uh... Hmm. What is strand? Yep. Crack it. Yep. And a savannah. Mm hmm. A four for fury. Five, but yep, sure. Yes, I five. Uh, I will target two damage to Inti and one damage to Noble Hierarch, one damage to Boo. Okay. Yep. Sorry, to Minsk Boo, not to Boo. Yes, I understood. <laughs> uh, I will. Move to combat. Yep. I will attack with Seasoned Engineer. If it protection, I will explore. Uh, are you attacking me or Boo? Or uh, I'm attacking you. I am attacking you. Okay. That's my fault. Uh, yeah. Uh, I it will five. deal five, and I'll take back the initiative. Yep. I will take a trap, uh, leading you to take another five. Yep. Happy. And my turn. I guess go to combat and attack you. Yeah, you got this. 
I didn't want you to trap me, so I felt like I had to attack. Yeah, that's fair. Right. I'll take the play. Yep, seems reasonable. I will keep this. Um... Sure, I'll try the sand. Start us off. Right. Swept teeth? Yep. Back it. I'll find the taiga and play Oslap Bide. Alright. Uh, not taiga. I'll take two life to misstep that. Yeah, yeah, you gotta get a white source. <laughs> yeah. I meant plateau, but I said taiga, which makes no sense. Let's play this Overgrown Tomb and Dread Fugue you. Yep. Alright. Uh, I will take the Clowning Round. Yep. And then I'll also go. Rainforest. Yep. Uh, Exile the Simeon Spirit Guide for red. Cast this. Yep. Seek the Beast. Exiling Treasure Cruise Catcher Trial. Play the Catcher Trial. And this cruise is just going to stay in exile. So. Pass the turn. <laughs> I will crack Misty Rainforest. Yep. I will find Savannah. Yep. A2 to play Call. I will find I'll find Spin Hot Spin Hot Man to go. Okay. We'll put that in my hand. I will pay two for Nantuko. Okay. I will play a commercial district. Trigger Nantuko. Yes. An insect. Yep. I will prevail one. Yes. I will keep that on top. To go. All right. Draw. Um, play this underground sea. Cast this questing druid. Mm -hmm. Play this mox emerald. Play this nether goyf trigger questing druid. Yep. Uh, it's currently a two three. Then I will pass. Right. I will flame slash the goyf. Okay. 
cast this revitalizing repast, trigger questing druid, targeting my other glyph. Yep. Okay, so it gets a counter. And it triggers. Play a less portico? Yes. Trigger an Intuka? Yep. Yeah. I will put that in my grave. Okay. I will pay one by Noble High Rock. Okay. And I will pass my turn. Uh, to cycle this generous end. Mm hmm. Go and get a. Getting this underground mortuary, which I will play for turn. Get a one. I'm going to put this dragon switch in my graveyard. It's a little bit bigger. I'll go to combat and attack with Metagoyf. I will... Right now it's a 4-5. Yep. I will take 4. Okay. I will... I will A4 for Headliner Scarlet. Yep. I will... Yeah. We'll move to combat. I will attack for 6. Yep, I take 6, staff 10. And I will pass the 10. One, two, three, four, five. I'll we'll cast this Moloch X equals three. Get the questing druid. Yep. So it comes in with three counters. I will have it fight Headliner Scarlet. Headliner Scarlet will die? Uh, it gets exiled. Oh, yes. Uh, then I will go to combat and swing for four, eight. I will. I will block the question to it. Yep. A four. Okay. And then I will pass. A3 for Sanguine Evangelist. Yep. I will pass it down. Draw. This IR is sworn. Requesting yep. druid. Yeah. I will go to combat. Yep. Act with two five fives and a four five. Okay. I will block the questing to it. And take nine. 
Yes. And he didn't have some sort of trick there? No. Uh, oh, pass. And tap upkeep draw. I will pay three. Oh, strength of the harvest. Targeting that. Oh. Well, unfully your bat in response. Yeah. Hmm. In your graveyard. Ah, yes. Pass it then. Okay. Untap, keep drawing. Okay. How are you getting out of this? <laughs> uh, I'll just go to combat. With everything, yeah, you got this. Okay. Well, I went 3 0 today. Uh, it kind of doesn't really count because we only had four people today, so it was a round robin instead of a full on Swiss like normal. But deck was sweet, deck performed really well, everything just felt awesome. I, you know, I, I didn't really feel like I was playing with bad cards, which I guess is sort of the point of playing four color. Psychic Frog was sweet today. Um, it's been a long time since I played with Minskinboo, and I saw it a lot today. Boy, that card is messed up. <laughs> uh, it's, it's pretty nuts. Uh, Question Druid also was really impressive today. I was very impressed with Question Druid. I'm kind of surprised I didn't see it that much play. I guess it's kind of bad with counter spells, so a lot of the decks that would want a grow threat like this tend to have a lot of counter spells, so if you had counter spells, Seek the Beast is not very good. But card felt really cool today. Resting Druid and Moss Witch Red Knight both felt sweet. Just like a who's who of the best two and three drops. Which, you know, that was sort of the point of the deck, but I'm glad it worked out. I think the deck is sweet. It's got like the nice a nice level of aggression and interaction. I didn't feel like I was I didn't feel like I was failing to find threats, but I also wasn't completely failing to find interaction. So it was like I could I had a nice mix of interaction and threats, which felt really good. Maybe I just got really lucky today. Uh, that's definitely possible, but deck feels really cool. So even though this was sort of a more casual tournament today, I think that this deck is pretty sweet. I'm probably going to keep tinkering with it a little bit and uh, probably see some more of it on this channel, you know, going forward. But yeah, just trying to think what else to say. I definitely, it's been a long time since I've played with like Minskin Boo and, uh, you know, played a sort of more mid-range game. I mean, like I said, it's been like a month since I last played Magic, so there was definitely that time that Vast uh, said I had him killed in like five different ways, and I missed all of them. So that was a little embarrassing, but I had some sweet starts with, you know, very aggressive early draws, backed up by Disruption. Um, this is what I feel like an aggro deck should feel like in 2024. It shouldn't feel like you have to wait to get the three mana to do anything, or you get stalled out. It should feel like it has the ability to go really fast, but also grind really hard. And uh, I think that this is a potential way of doing it. Like I said, I think blue is heavily underexplored in aggro decks. You know, I'm calling it an aggro deck. I guess it's more of a mid-range deck, but I think blue is heavily underexplored in these shells. And uh, yeah, I'm probably going to keep testing this. So thanks for watching the video. Uh, have a great day. I will see you next time.